It has hit fever pitch as Principal Secretary Interior Raymond Domolo gives an all-systems go for this year's celebration to be held at Uhuru Gardens in Nairobi. Now, during an inspection tour at the venue, Pierre Somolo stated that the preparations ahead of the day are complete, with the final touches expected to be done Monday. Kenyans have been called upon to turn up for the national celebrations, with 30,000 people expected at the grounds, and at least three heads of state expected to jet into the country for the celebrations. Cognizance of the role that the youth play in building this nation and we participate in activities that would empower, embolden and make uh, the youths to be the real source of hope for the next generation in this country. We expect that uh, the celebrations are going to be rolled out in other parts of the country, across uh, all the counties, the sub-counties, and the divisions. And uh, for those who will not be able to make it to Uru Gardens on Tuesday, we advise that they celebrate with us in their respective uh, locations. We have made adequate security arrangements, and starting today until after the celebrations on the 12th, this ground will be covered uh, by our brothers from uh, KDF as well as the National Police Service for purposes of ensuring that we have uh, a successful event. Of course, uh, the security deployment is uh, in place for the rest of the city as well as uh, the country. Then uh, lastly is that uh, we are looking forward to also have the finals of the Talanta Hela football tournament that has been going on, which will happen at Nyayo Stadium on the 12th in the afternoon. Now, to inject energy into the development of farming.